Mm -hmm. Ready? Yeah, I really let's do it. I really don't remember her at all. I gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. Yeah, lure one out of the kitchen, probably. And let's go find the kitchen. I really do not remember her whatsoever. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. What they always weddings? Oh, yeah, they're a full service site. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, black market auctions. What do they have DJ? I'm trying to see if there's any treasures out here. I doubt it, but. So I didn't try to open the door in there. <laughs> nah, just more heavily armed goons. Okay. The hell is this? This game wasn't on the blueprint. Jesus Christ, man, this place is a fort. Unlocked, of course. Okay, plan B. I told you it's locked. Trust, but verify. And? It's locked. Right. <laughs> I figured they were gonna do something, that's why, that's why I went ahead and pressed the triangle. There you go. Say, let me tell you, it, it's yeah, it's pretty strong to do that. There. I mean, I've never pushed one myself. Hey, come check this out. But that's a lot of. I mean, I, that, I'm assuming that's a that's a wine keg. And there we big, go. So. I can only Let imagine there be must luck. be heavy as heck. Got electrical in this joint. <sighs> Don't suppose you brought a. Yeah, that'll do. Well, I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Oh, it's... I don't know, I just like the way it looks. Cause since he's carrying it, you don't you're not the one with the light, so everything seems a little dimmed still. No, nothing there. Okay. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Nothing there. Oh, okay. I gotta push that out the way, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's gotta be it. Oh, yeah. That's where you came in though, isn't it? Uh, no, I don't think so. <sighs> Dead end. Instead of pushing, hey, I gotta uh, drag it. She'll be worried that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross. That's some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. Because I can, I come can talk his way out of anything. Words. You get me? Yeah. I'm gonna go around. around. Beautiful. 
Uh, this way. Right, come on, Sam. Keep up. Hey, look, the vents. That's our way out. What? Yep. Let's find something to climb on. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding the lighter. Holding the lighter. <laughs> Yeah, some of Just in case. I doubt there's anything there. It usually flashes by now. Can't see shit. Alright. Okay, up we go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? And a lot more dusty. Cosa portiamo a quell'odioso miliardario tedesco? Questo con il parrucchino e quella roba sul naso. Portali. Ah, sciacco tu dei piatti. Tanto non capirete la differenza. Man, you would hear this a mile away. Two grown men walking in a in an AC shaft or a ventilation shaft, I should say. Can wake me? Yeah. Mind you, with dress shoes, which is like practically the equivalent of heels for, for men. Back this way. Okay. Fresh air, here we come. Check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. A boost. Give me a boost. Somewhere. Yep. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All you. right. Thing you kept in shape. There you go. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, that must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Yeah, he's doing all right. Bingo. Found the kitchen. Sully. And of course it's locked. Oh, there you go. Another boost, my dear Sam, brother. Look. Broda. Maybe we can use that and find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Oh, you're boosting me up. Really? Oh, 
Buonasera. Ma che sta facendo? He's the other civilian, Sam. What? So he wakes up with a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. <laughs> okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. Not that. Seriously. Yeah. Sam, you there? What the hell? Sam? Sully? Great. Oh, fuck. That's not good. That's never good. <laughs> Okay, just like riding a bike. Several hundred feet in the air. Should I get in there? Or? I'm not sure if I should. Yeah, you should. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to jump back out the window. Yeah. Because there's no. just to get, yeah. <clears throat> Go here. Spider-Man, practically. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. Yeah. Huh. Climbing up though, don't I? Maybe there's another spot to climb yeah, up. Yeah, let's, let's see, because I can't find it. I don't see how I could go further up anymore. Oh, this is the only thing I can think of here coming over in this side. No. Let's get on top of the roof again. <coughs> and then look to the right. Maybe you can grab No, because see, I'm, um, I gotta. Um, do I have to I yeah, try maybe jump from roof. this roof? No, but that's isn't that where I went? I don't think so. Are you sure? Yeah, you came from the other side. Alright. Mm -hmm. There we go. 
guys will have to excuse us if you uh, if you hear my dog snoring in the back. He's just right next to us. I know we're playing kind of late <coughs> for him. Yeah, it's definitely past his bedtime. <coughs> Subtle. Real subtle. <laughs> I can't believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh? Like, dead out? Oh, no. More like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> oh, shit. Victor Sullivan! How the hell are you? Rafe? How long has it been? Ten years? Twelve? Fifteen. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. <laughs> oh, that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. What would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big scores. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah. I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but um <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. See? <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item. An inlaid wooden crucifix from the Figured Protestant. Out. It wasn't just well, a coincidence that I know when I'm a third wheel. You two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? And what it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. Now, I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe! Body. Get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Damn. Should have decked the run face. Nate? God damn it, kid. Where the hell are you? Should have. We talked to somebody like that. Okay. Power room. I can do this. I don't see how Nate is going to get back into the party. He's not. They're going to take the thing. Nate's just going to turn off the light. <laughs> and Sam, dressed as a waiter, is going to get through everybody to get the thing. Oof, I didn't think I was going to make it there. Okay, yeah, because I was going to say, man, Nate is looking pretty rough right now. <laughs> to go back into a, a party like that, looking like this. God, why did I pick the power room? <laughs> no, that's her own. Right? Yeah. No, that's a little hole. Yeah, yeah, okay. I don't know, sorry guys. I was just looking around and I thought I could go somewhere else. Oh, like a boss. Turn around. What do you think? Left or right? Left. 
Left? Yeah. All right, left it is. And you're wrong. <laughs> Should have gone with my instinct. Which was go right. Are you kidding me right now, Nate? Are you serious? <laughs> there we go. Good lord. Shit, I did not notice that guy. di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? I feel like we shouldn't talk either. Like this, this scene, like every, it happens to me every time in a game that there's a scene like this where it's, you know, you're like, you're supposed to be quiet, you're sneaking around. I, I, I feel like I, I should be quiet. Like I just, I should not be saying a word. Like if I'm gonna disrupt the game or something. So if you guys are there and you guys can hear us or don't hear us, it's it's cause of that. We're just like, both of us are just like eyes wide now, open. Where the hell are the circuit breakers? Literally, at least me, I am practically holding my breath. Wasn't there a game like that that it, you had to talk into the Sam, like, Sully, you there? Damn it, kid, where the hell you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but. Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Hey, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing it, remember? What if he calls my bluff? <sighs> he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once? Going twice. Uh, screw it. Then may we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. And for a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. <laughs> okay. Just gotta smash the lock. But with what? Now the bid has reached 130,000. Nope. We are now at 140. Holy shit, dude. Hurry up. Nothing. Are Damn you it. serious? Come on. All the way to 150, euros. It's gotta be something. Come on. I'm just going to swing as fast as I can. Yeah. Give me a sec. Yes. Perfect. Really? You, fi makes 170, you find the crowbar. In, in a, a death. <laughs> yeah, in a drawer in a death. <laughs> gotcha. But not in the toolbox or anywhere else. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid: two hundred thousand euros. Five hundred thousand. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have five hundred thousand euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? 
We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall sell it for 500,000. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Sam, tell me you got the cross. Got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Alright, guys. Well, we're going to go ahead and call it there. It's been fun. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and uh, until next time, guys, take it easy. Bye, guys.